Well, it's always an adventure finding out just where Kim is and what trouble <laughs> she may have gotten herself into. You never know, honestly. But ABC 36's Kim Dixon is with Paul Lawrence Dunbar High School talking about an upcoming production that they have coming up. Hey, Kim. Hey, Doug and Lisa, you know, you never know where I'm going to end up, and I'm always getting into trouble, but today I'm trying to be good. I'm here with Lindsay Sovkaplus, who is a teacher and the director of Little Shop of Horrors here at Paul Lawrence Dunbar High School. Hey, Lindsay! Hey, thanks for coming to see us. Oh, thank you so much for letting me join you. We are on the set right now. Little Shop of Horrors is a classic. Now, tell us very briefly in a couple sentences what the show is about for those of us who don't know. Absolutely. So this is a beautiful musical, epic music. There's a down and out little uh, florist, and he's in love with his coworker, and he finds this really special plant, and that's pretty much all I'm going to tell you because you're going to have to come see. Uh-oh. I think I might know where this is going, and we've got a little danger going on here, but something that's really cool about this production is you have students involved in all aspects. Tell me a little bit about that. We do. We have students everywhere. Student leadership as an assistant director, assistant choreographer, musical director, lighting design, sound design, designing the the set, building the set, everything, you name it. Oh my gosh, and that includes the people on stage too as well. Now, we don't always see students in these kinds of positions, designing and choreographing and working with the director as an assistant. What are these things, these are some different types of skills and how do we translate those into our everyday lives and our adult lives. Yeah, absolutely. So the organizational skills of putting a show on from start to finish behind the scenes, how in, seeing how everything kind of comes together to create a bigger picture, all of these things are super applicable to almost any career you're going to head into in the future. That makes a lot of sense. So theater, it's not just about fun and having fun on stage, but this really do teach us a lot of good life lessons. Absolutely. Skills from technical to creative, it covers all, all the bases. I love that. Now, we do have something a little bit special here today. This plant that you were telling me about, we see in different iterations throughout its, shall I say, growth process. Oh, absolutely. Oh. It's growing. <laughs> so let's meet the plant, okay? So this is Audrey 2. This is Audrey 2. Audrey 2, this is in one of our larger stages. We're growing up a little bit now. Now, something that's interesting that not all people seem to understand is that a puppet like Audrey 2 is actually the culmination of two people. Yeah, absolutely. So, so we have Carson here. Hey, Carson, how are you today? Hi, I'm doing great. You're a student here at Dunbar, and you're also the voice of Audrey, too, yes? Yeah. Now, how do you do that? Do you hide behind the plant? or Where are, where are you during the show? Are you in? What's going on? I'm going to be in the pit. So you perform from the pit, from the orchestra pit, yes? Yeah. Okay, and then we have a puppeteer inside, is that correct? Correct. All right, now, I... Um, I understand that it might be snack time for this large plant, yes? And we've come prepared. Oh, it's a with burger. A class hamburger. Okay, so so this is taught this was created in a class, in it a theater is. class uh -huh. here. So okay, so now I'm gonna feed the plant. Okay, here I am approaching the mouth. Okay, do I drop it in? Just drop it in. Drop it in. Oh, okay, oh, yeah. oh, 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 there, oh, oh it's, she's she's hung, she's eating, she's eating. Oh my gosh, that's fantastic. Now, Audrey. Can you show me some of your moves? Oh, oh, oh dear, oh dear. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Now, Audrey, I hear that you might have something to tell us. What can you tell us as the plant right now? What does the plant want to say? If I can talk and I can move, who's to say I can't do anything I want? <gasps> oh my gosh, that's amazing. So come on, y'all, tell us how we can come and see this amazing plant and this wonderful musical Little Shop of Horrors. How do we, how do we come and see the show? Yeah, come see us at Paul Lawrence Dunbar next weekend, the 21st, 22nd, and 23rd. We've got four public show times, and we'd love to see you. How do we get tickets? You go to pldtheater.ludus.com. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Lindsay. Thank you so much, Carson. Thank you so much, Isaiah, in there. I really appreciate it. I'm going to give you a little kiss, okay? <laughs> <Mwah>. <laughs> Thank you all so much. And now we're going to go back to Doug and Lisa in the studio. You don't want to stand too close to Audrey there when she's uh, when she's feeling a little peckish.